Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to do an update for my finished 20 in 2020. By the first update or something I changed it just to a rolling project pan that I want to finish 20 in 2020 but when I used one up I rolled another one in. So that is just what I have been doing in the last three months and I have been really enjoying working on a different kind of products and stuff like that. For this month I have three empties and I'm really excited about it so let me just show you them and then my progress overall not amazing but not bad either so that is really exciting I think. My first empty is my Skin Academy Pure Cleansing Facial Scrub. I was up to here when I put it in and last time I was down to here. Now I'm done. Really excited about this. I don't have any scrubs for my face anymore so I do think I'm going to miss it, but for right now, I, I think I will be fine. The next one is my W7 Eye Dream Shadow Cream, and this is in Copper Pot. And this is my second cream shadow in this product that I have used up, which is really exciting, but the first one I decluttered because I didn't get any use out of it. This one I am calling done because it, well, it is a kind of dry. But I can't get any more on the wand. I have used it up and it is really thin around the sides even though it seems like there's a lot of product down here. There really isn't. So this is done and I'm going to roll another one in which I'm really excited about and I'm wearing it today actually. The next one is my MAC Pro Longwear Concealer. I just, I'm just going to call it done. I don't want the hassle. I don't want to look it up. I really don't care enough for that. It's not cruelty free so I just want it gone from my collection basically. I really 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 love this concealer but it's not, it's not worth it. Okay, it's not worth it. So yeah, my MAC Pro Longwear Concealer in NW15 is done. You may see the product in the bottom but I don't want the hassle to open this up and not getting it to be recycled if you know what I mean. I don't know if I'm going to do that anyway because I have five items but the last two items that I have that can be back to Mac, you know, is an eyeshadow and a blush and I'm not going to finish them anytime soon. But yes, this is done. Let's take the products that I haven't used. I haven't used my Dove 7 Life's a Beach Beach Body Contour. Not cream, contour. This is an illuminating product that you put all over your body and it is going to be shiny and it's really beautiful in the summertime but I haven't used it at all. I have considered using it in my body lotion but I haven't gotten that far to actually put it in because I really want to mix them and not applying this on top or the other. So yeah, it is still up to the line right there. Haven't used my heat protection spray at all. Then we have these two products. I actually thought I will get more use out of my W7 Double Prime Lips and Brows Duo Primer. I just didn't. My lips are just too dry and flaky so my lipstick is not wearing that well on top of this. It does work, it really does, but there's no progress to show on the paper. As well as my P2 Impressive Gel, Gel Eyeliner in dramatic blue. It is a lovely eyeliner but I just don't use it because I'm really focusing on my black gel eyeliner in my Partners in Cream project pan. I do think I can have them done by the end of the year if I start focusing on them. But I have more than half a year to go so let's see if I can do it. Yeah I have a goal that I'm going to end this project before baby comes but let's see. Let's see. I'm due mid-October. Mid there's a while left. Five months. Okay. I have my One Direction Our Moment perfume that I'm using every single day. And I'm finally below the wide part of the bottle. Um, so I'm actually down to this line right here. I have no idea if you can see it. I just marked it. I will mark it with a nail polish so you can see it more clearly next time. But I'm really excited about that progress actually. And... Yeah, I think this will go a lot quicker now that I'm past the white part of the bottle. I have my W7 Glow It All Glow Serum. I have the tiniest line right there. It's so tiny. I didn't use it this month only once, I think. So 
yeah, mm -hmm. that's not very good. It will go really quickly if I just take my mind to use it because I do think the big marking in between here that is like two weeks of use. So if I combine that to a month, yeah, that will be quite fast. I can finish that. Okay, something I didn't talk about last time because I went out of battery, which I'm also right now. I will do my best. It is my serum from the Body Shop, the, you, the Drops of Youth serum. As you can see, I have made a lot of progress this month. I'm really excited about it. But yes, I love this serum so much and I'm going to be so sad when I don't have it anymore. But yes, I have amazing progress on that one. I have used this a few times this month and that is actually really bad because my lips are so, 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 so dry. Um, as I said, for the lip primer. This is the W7 Jelly Lip Crush Lip Scrub. Maybe you can see... I have a dip my finger in here. Right there. So I'm going to use this more. I am. Because... My lips are dry. Um, I have used this Himalayan charcoal mask from the body shop a few times. Maybe you can see some progress on it. I do love it. My Matas Natura Salt Body Scrub. I have so little left. I really want to use it up by next update. As you can see, I have only this little corner left. Um, but yeah, I do think I can finish it that up by next update. I have my Rituals, the Ritual of Sakura Magic Touch Body Cream. I did mix in a hand cream that... It's not the one that I have in this project. I should have done that, but I didn't. I used another one. And I mixed it in with this because I, I don't use hand cream that often. So I just put it in this container to use it uh, with it. And that is where I am right now. So it may be there's a little bit more or maybe the same amount as last time. But yes, I still love this so much and the consistency haven't changed even though I put in the hand cream. So that is really, really nice. And again, I have thought about adding the illuminator to that one. I've used my NYX Contour Powder Blush in taupe a few times, but I don't think you can see some progress. I have my eye primer from Devi7. It is the I Got The Power Eye Primer. Last time I did depart this because I thought I was almost done. I was not. But yes, let me show you the progress from last time to now. As you can see, I have a lot of progress on the amount that I had left in this container. Maybe I can use it up by next update. That would be so exciting. But yes, I do predict this being here for like two months. <laughs> um... Yeah, I'm saving the broken bones at the last. I have my W7 Touch and Go Blemish Concealer Pencil, which is not for my blemishes. This is illuminating. I use it in my inner corner only. Yeah, this one right here. It's just a pencil that you can sharpen and everything. Um, I use it every single day. At least I try to. And that is my progress this month. Yeah, not a lot, but I'm using it and it doesn't go very fast and I did predict that But I just wanted to use it more and I am which is nice I have my the balm red cream blush and this is where I am now compared to last time I do think I have some progress to show you guys <laughs> I really hope so I am using it every single day and I really love it still But I really want it gone at the same time now I'm so tired of it. Let's take the disaster before the new products that I'm adding in. I have... It's not the bourgeois. It is a Franken bronzer. And before you get excited, I don't have that much pan actually in the product. The pan here in the middle, that is organic pan that I hit after I repressed it. So that is pretty exciting that it is proper pan now, but I dropped it. Obvious. I'm so stupid. I dropped it. On my makeup table, it was closed, so nothing landed on the floor or anything. So I saved the pieces. I put them in an eyeshadow pan that is empty. So I'm going to repress them in another pan. Not in this one, because I, I can't be bothered. But I really want to use those up as well. But yes, this is my progress and I'm pretty excited about it. I hit pan on a bronzer again. 
that exercising. The products that I'm adding in for the three products that I used up. The first product I'm adding in is my The Body Shop British Rose Shower Gel. And I really want to use this up. Oh my god. I am up to here or down to here, whatever you say. So about halfway done and yeah, I really want it gone. And I only use the shower gel right now, but I don't go through shower gel that quickly. I am adding in another Eye Dream Shadow Cream from W7 and this is a Gilded Cage. 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 Gilded Cage. And this is a light, light cream eyeshadow, but I really, really enjoy it. I have put some jojoba oil drops in it already because I couldn't get anything out. And this is completely new. I have used it maybe five times the most before this project. And I have it on my eyelids underneath a shimmer shadow today. The last item that I have to add into this project before I can end this video, it is the W7 Lip Twister in Rust. And I do have it on every single morning now because I don't, I'm not working on a lip liner, so I'm just using this. And I have it on today underneath this liquid lipstick. Which was not a smart choice of me today because my lips are so dry. <laughs> but here we are. That is everything that I have left of this. I will mark it for next time. But I hopefully can have this done by next update. I really hope so. I'm crossing my fingers to have it done. That is everything for this video. Before my camera cuts me off, I'm going to end it right here. For once I did talk about all of my products. I hope you enjoyed this video. I did my very best to have amazing progress for you guys this month. I'm doing better at this project than my others, but let's not talk about that. Let's not. I hope you guys enjoyed. Subscribe if you haven't already. If you're new here, that is not subscribe, that is a like button. Like this video if you liked it and subscribe down below if you're new here. I would love for you to be a part of my small family on here. And until my next video, please take care. Bye.